Hello everyone, welcome to Cat Tool Guide channel. In this video, we will see quickly about what is a Cat Tool and how to start with the free Cat Tool Omega T. Shall we start? First, let's begin with what is a Cat Tool. So, Cat Tool is computer aided or computer assisted translation software it helps both the translator and language service providers or translation companies or agencies to benefit from using cat tools for example it helps translators do more work in less time for example if a translator spends 8 hours to complete a 2000 word translation, now if the translator uses a CAD tool, he or she can do it in less time. And it also allows to consolidate the work, that is the monthly work or yearly work, all the translation done through a CAD tool will be saved in a translation memory. It also helps to improve the efficiency of the translator not only that the consistency of translation as well as typing effort and time are saved indirectly it also saves cost for a translator now getting to the point of LSP you may remember that every translation company will be dealing thousands or lakhs or even more the number of words in translation project by using a cat tool they will be able to build a huge translation database by using this database they will be able to save a lot of time effort and also they can make huge cost saving because when you get a huge TM, your probability of matches in future project will be more. So, thereby the cost saving will occur not only in the repetitive text but also in regular projects also. Next, now let us uh, start talking about the Omega T. So, Omega T is a wonderful option to start with. If you are a student or if you are new in translation field or you may be a professional translator, Omega T is a nice option to start with because it is free and open source. So, you don't have to invest a huge uh, cost for buying the software and it it is backed by a good support team so if you face any issues you can always get to the official support team and get your issues resolved and there is a wonderful wonderful support team for resolving your issues they if you ask any question they will very quickly reply to your uh, queries and thereby helping you to resolve your issues in a very short time so it is this software is from an open source world so you can customize it and uh, make changes if you are a programmer and coming to the operating system omega t works on windows linux mac and sun solaris operating system it is a wonderful option for everyone now let's get on to the main uh, features of omega t okay the latest version of omega t is omega t beta 6.0 so as we said already it is a free and open source software it supports 30 plus file format right from word file excel powerpoint to srt InDesign, FrameMaker and a lot of file formats are supported by Omega T. And the highlight 
feature of the latest version of Omega T is that without using any additional plugin or doing any workaround, natively Omega T Beta supports the Trados bilingual format that is SDLX lib format. So you will be able to handle the SDLX lib format in Omega T without having to put any specific amount of time and uh, efforts so directly you can use Trados SDLX lib file in Omega T beta 6.0 and uh, it's well known that it works on Windows Linux Mac and Sun Solaris operating system next we have a good spell checker in Omega T and you can add certain language uh, features to the spell checker and uh, omega t also uses the universal standard which is tmx tmx is translation memory exchange file format so if your friend let us say uh, i am using omega t and my tm format is tmx let us say if my friend who is also a translator is using a different cat tool for example Trado studio or memoq i can share my tmx file to my friend who can import the tmx file into the their own cat tool be it Trados or memoq so tmx the translation memory exchange format it is the universal standard for interchange of tms so that is also a big advantage when you are using omega t and it supports machine translation and please note that it doesn't do machine translation but it supports machine translation like google translate and microsoft translate and many other translation service provider uh, both uh, free as well as the paid machine translation functionality can be used within omega t software the next feature is we can see the word count and statistics in omega t so in statistics we can see the uh, log detail that is exact match fuzzy match and no match category so as said uh, the exact match is 100% match that will be automatically substituted by Omega T uh, for example if I have translated a sentence already and if it is saved in the T TM it will be automatically substituted by Omega T so thereby I don't have to type it again and uh, it will save my typing effort as well as my time and uh, next feature is fuzzy match so any match from 51 percent to 99 percent is a fuzzy match or partial match so those things will be shown in a separate window in omega t apart from the translation window and there is also separate uh, window for glossary so your glossary term present in the current segment will be shown in the uh, glossary window of omega t and as indicated it supports txt csv and tbx tbx is term based exchange format which is the universal format for uh, exchange and interchange of term bases uh, and please do not be confused between tmx and tbx because tmx is a translation memory exchange format whereas tbx is the term base that is terminology database or in other words a glossary converted to term base uh, converted to a tbx format uh, that can be used in various terminology tool for example the official website of microsoft has a tbx formatted uh, glossaries for variant languages not only for indian language but also for many other international languages also okay next feature is file alignment for example if you have the separate source and target file you can align it using omega t 
to say in other words whatever translation done without the cat tool in that case you will have a separate source file and a target file for example i am a french translator so my source would be french and my target would be english so if i have a source french file and a equivalent english file i can use the align files menu in omega t and align the source and target file and thereby align every sen- segment in omega t editor and import this to my and uh, import and create uh, align the source and target file and create a translation memory so why do we do file alignment when we have a separate source and target file and if you want to build a translation memory from the from these source and target file then we use the file alignment feature okay next we have spelling and grammar checker uh, where uh, we can customize it and have additional functionalities apart from that we have qa checker tag checker and terminology checker so qa check uh, will help you to uh, eliminate uh, lot of errors and tag check is exclusively dedicated for checking the tags and terminology checker will ensure that the correct terminology is used if you are using a glossary and when you run the terminology verifier it will say whether the right target term is used for the specific source term and this is the official website of omega t so anyone can go to this website omega t.org and you can download the omega t standard version beta version or uh, the suitable version based on your operating system and start u- using it from today so thank you very much for watching this video please like subscribe and share this video to your friends thank you good day